So, y'all, this is a picture of my mother, bro. This is the lady that carried me for nine months. Getting picked at, getting bullied all over the internet. Now, this picture, this post is old, but just look at how early it was. You know what I'm saying? Like, and people doing this to my mama on social media. Like, and I know a lot of people on the outside looking in would be like, well, dang, if that's your mama, why you not taking care of your mama? Why are you not doing this? Why is she in that position and whatever? But let me tell y'all something. My mom, she suffered from mental illness. My mom, she's schizophrenic. She's bipolar. She got a lot going on. And my oldest brother, he committed suicide in 2013. And that triggered her and made her even worse than she already was. So it's like until my mom really get committed into a hospital and standing for a little while where she gets better, she's probably going to be not in the best position that she can be in. And with all that being said, you know, if you're crazy and you can't act right, you can't have a job, you can't make money, and you're going to be on them streets because you can't get your life together. So it's deeper than it sounds. But, you know, the whole purpose of this video is because I want y'all to see how evil people are and how corrupt people are. And it's crazy because people be wondering why they going through what they going through. But it's the shit that you out here doing. I never record nothing like this or take a picture of somebody sitting at no damn bus stop and put them on social media and pick at them. Mind you, I was all the way in California when somebody screenshot this and sent it to me and they had a screen recording where they was scrolling through the comments for me and showing me what a lot of people were saying. Like, yeah, man, that's that bitch that always be asking for change, man. She's so aggravating. Yeah, I be seeing her on the river all the time, man. She's so, man, that bitch crazy. Like, calling my mama a bitch and all. Like, motherfuckers just don't care. And then it be your own people. This black people shit. How many times you seen a white person take a picture of somebody and post this and pick at them? For anything, they'll be busy trying to help. You feel me? But I got my mama together, and I want y'all to see on this next video. Hold on. Do it again. I want y'all to see how beautiful my mama I is. And she don't deserve smile. that shit, but we all good over here. I want you to listen to me. Name me your ministry. Name me your church. Name me whatever it is religion that you're part of. And I want you to point out to me what structure do they have set in place to address people who are dealing with mental illness. I want you to name that to me. So you can preach to me all day about all your, we the tribe of Israel. Okay, well, let me ask you something. Does Israel got a mental institution? Do they got something set up to deal with people who have been mentally hurt and disrupted? Because if you don't have something set up like that, then shut up and get out of my face. Because this is a real issue. Because I can sit up here all day and go through genetics, talk about where your lineage came from and you came from here. But if we, if there's no conversations and I want you to do that, this is your assignment. All of these Hebrews, all of these Christians, all these people that you talked, you listen to on these platforms, ask them where on your platform do you deal with these issues specifically? Because if that ain't being addressed, then, then you're just wasting your time. Cause I'm telling you, this is a big issue. It's a very big issue.